Welcome to another SRI New Home Showcase. My name is Ainsley and today we're here at Tembusu Grand, a rising of an icon in the heart of Patong that is developed by two of Singapore's most reputable developers. We've got CDL as well as MCL. So let's go and meet Ken Lo, our managing partner, to find out a little bit more. So Ken, do share a little bit more about this unique venture between the two top reputable developers that uh, we have here today. So we all know that CDL and MCL has always been a household name for one of the top yep. developers in Singapore. Sure. They are well known for their design, the mm. functionality of their layouts and the quality of the homes that they have built over yep. the years. So I think it's very exciting to see the two of them coming mm. together to develop quality homes within Singapore. They started off last year with Piccadilly Grand and yep. Copen Grand. Okay. And both projects have been the top selling in 2022. In fact, Copen Grand have been fully sold within months of the launch. Sure. Today, we are happy to see them coming together to develop Tambusu Grand within such a prime and attractive location in the heart of District 15. So Ken, we've been seeing so many District 15 launches. So what's special of Tembusu Grand that we need to take note of? If we segregate out District 15 into different key areas, there are a lot of launches actually taking place within places like your Amber area, Mayer, Mountbatten. Mm -hmm. All these launches, if you realise over the years, have been using Katong as one of the key selling points sure, within thanks. the proximity of Katong. Today, Tembusu Grand is located within the heart of Katong itself. Mm. And if you look at the precinct of Katong, over the past more than 20 years, we yep. didn't have a launch in this area. The last notable and sizable one okay. is Head Court, ah. which is just located behind Tembusu right, right, Grand. Okay, okay. That project TOP in 2004, yep. the wait is finally over. Mm. We are finally seeing an iconic launch within the heart of Katong. The right. rising of an icon, right? Yes. Yep. Okay. So we've always loved Katong. What's so special about this area, I mean, in your opinion. Katong is a very unique neighbourhood as compared to the rest of Singapore. Yep. It actually goes way back into the history of when Singapore is forming up. So in the past, Katong has always been a recreation fishing village area where people around Singapore would come in for their weekend mm -hmm. holidays and stuff like that. So when the government finally decided to redevelop Katong into a residential area, okay. that's where the first inhabitants that came in were actually your Peranakans and English-speaking population. Mm. So I think this part of the history has lived on until now, which is why if you look at the entire Katong enclave, you find a lot of the colourful Peranaka shops. And what is important is also to know that in this small Katong enclave, our plot ratio, majority of them are standing at about 1.4 plot ratio at most. Right which is as high as up to five storeys high. Sure. Right, so there's a very low density quaint living within yep. Katong itself. And we have all the famous eateries that everybody yep. know about, the character of the shop houses that litter around this whole yep. area. The tallest building all these years have been hit caught. It was standing at 17 storey high. And finally, with Tembusu Grand coming in, we are going to see a modern building of up to 21 storey high. I can already imagine next time if I drive through Katong, I would enjoy the modernity mixing together with the old charm within District 15. Alright, so at Katong, being a very old estate, a very mature old charm that we have here, uh, are there any more potentials? You know, every time when, when, when buyers come in, they always look for potential upside, right? Are there any more potential for this location, for Tembusu Grand? Even though we are in District 15, mm. we are labelled to be in the east. Yeah. But if you look at the location of where Katong, Tembusu Grand, is we are in fact nearer to the downtown of Singapore as compared to the distance to the eastern part of Singapore where your Tampines right. and um, sure. the airport is. We are so near to the downtown area that we are actually being surrounded by a lot of macro redevelopments mm. that will happen in the next few years. Tambusu Grand is situated in an enclave that is flanked by one of the most affluent landed areas in Singapore, which is a Mountbatten, and all the conservation shop houses that are all around mm. us. What is exciting is that Tembusu Grand, although after 20 years being the first launch, is just the start of many other launches that may come yeah. into this area. If you look at the map that we are going to show you now, you can see that this current show flat location we are standing on is actually another residential plot with a plot ratio of up to 3.5. And beside us is another similar plot that can yield more than 800 over units. And this plot of land is already listed in the government land sales reserve list. So okay. there will definitely be another new launch coming up. And as we all know, in these recent times, all the land prices have been creeping upwards yep. aggressively. Sure. So I'm pretty sure that buyers who buy into Tembusu Grand will definitely see an immediate paper appreciation the moment your neighbouring plot is being bidded. Right. And I believe the land prices will definitely be higher. Right, makes a lot of sense, yep. Okay, so what is interesting to also know that all this while when District 15 is one of the top districts within the 
the Asia, um, we do not have an MRT line running through. Um, so be, even before the completion of the Musu Grand, we will start to see the entire Thomson East Coast line completing. This add-on will definitely boost the prices and the livability of District 15 even further. The Musu Grand is actually about 7 to 10 minutes stroll away from your upcoming Tanjung Katong MRT station. And what is also important to know is that Tembusu Grand is located within 1 km to all the top elite primary schools nice. in District 15, okay. uh, namely your Hick Girls School, Tanjung Katong Primary mm. and Kong Hua. That's very, very nice. Um, I think it's about time for us to move on to the model, shall we? Yep, let's go. So looking at this majestic model, I can tell how this will look like along Tanjong Katong Road. Um, this is going to be really, really an icon. So can you share us a little bit more about this development right here? So I think CDL and MCL has done a very fantastic job mm. because they have wanted to bring in luxury into Tembusu Grand. Okay. With the look of it, you can see that they have brought in all the luxury very elements nice. yep. that they have done with their experience in District 9 and 10 projects. Mm -hmm. You can see that the elements, the colour that they chose, the curtain glass wall across these buildings is really timeless. So with all the facilities later as we move around the yeah. model to introduce, you can also realise that simplicity is something that they wanted to bring in. We are actually 638 units sitting on a land size of more than 210,000 square feet across four towers. Out of the three towers, they are 20 storey high. One of the towers is 21 storey high. 21 storey. So we have units ranging all the way from one plus study to five bedrooms, including two very exclusive penthouses. The Tech has also designed all the blocks to have a general north-south facing. We either have units that are facing the internal facilities that are beautiful okay. or facing outside where you have unblocked views across the entire low-rise surrounding that we are in. Right. And as you see, before we move to the facility to have a look, as you can see from this entire grand drop-off area, yes. the amount of space that is given yep. is already a lot larger than yep. a lot of developments. You seldom find a rival sculpture that stays fully done like what we see here if you are not within the core region. We also have a residential service counter where it doubles up as a concierge service for the residents. And this team of concierge is actually trained by CDL themselves. Oh wow! So it's actually a home brand that they are very, very proud of. So this is the kind of luxury that they have brought in to Tamusu Grand. Very very nice. Shall we have a look at the facility? Yes, please. Wow, well, Ken, I can see that you're really, really right. Um, so much facilities right here, right in the heart of Tembusu Grand. Um, and of course, there's so much of space. Um, do share a little bit more about the facilities. Yeah, like so what we mentioned about the luxury that yes. um, the both developers want to bring in, you can see that there's a lot of open space. So this is the heart of Tembusu Grand, uh, sure. whereby you find three pools in the middle. Okay. Um, of course, we have the usual 50 meters infinity yep. pool with the head where you have your function room and a clubhouse over mm -hmm, here. Mm -hmm. As you pan your eyes over towards that direction, you can see different layers of facilities that yes, take place at different height. These layerings actually create a very nice view when you are on ground and you yep. look up, you can feel the majestic uh, facilities right. that are all surrounding you. So I think the architect has done a very good job to have tucked away all the main activities area on that corner. Yep. That's where headquarters is. Okay. So you actually have your multi-storey car park, mm. all the activities like your gym and everything mm. that's there. So I think it creates a very nice buffer away and it's very neat in that sense. Well, I'm actually really loving what I see right here. Um, and of course, with the strength of this location and the design of this whole development, I'm pretty sure that the resale value and the demand in future will be super amazing. I cannot wait to see the show units right now. Shall we go? Let's go. So we're here at the 2 plus study, 743 square feet. Show unit, can you share with us a little bit more? So all units in Tembusu Grand actually comes with this metal gate. It is actually one of the elements to actually achieve the VCA green mark across the entire development. Sure. This gate allows you to have security and still allow cross ventilation right. to flow through from the door all the way to the balcony. Right, yeah. it makes a lot of sense. Yeah. Because of north south facing, right? Okay. And of course, some of the key highlights about this unit is this study area. Although it's a study area, but it is actually quite universal. You can design it to be a walk in closet mm. or even use it as a guest room because there's an aircon that's provided. This study is the same size as what you can find in a one plus study units as well. On the other side, we also want to show you the kitchen. Although it's open concept now, but it's very rare to find a two-bedroom where you have two sides of the kitchen. Yeah. In future, as you collect your keys, you can choose to make it enclosable if you want to. Right. If you look at the theme of the colours of what the developers have provided for the one bedrooms all the way to three bedrooms, they are using a contemporary scheme whereby you see the colours tend to be a lot cooler okay. as compared to the four and five bedrooms, which yeah. I'll show you later. As the camera pan through the rest of the rooms, you can see that we have very sizable rooms. All the common rooms are actually at least nine square meters okay which is slightly bigger than the usual of um, other developments that we find of about eight square meters there about okay
Welcome to our 3 plus study unit, 1173 square feet and can share with us your thoughts. So this little L shape before you enter into the main yep. area gives a lot of privacy, especially with the metal gate, you can leave the door open and people can look through. Yep. So again, I like this part about the kitchen as well. It's sizable, naturally ventilated. Okay. On both sides, we have windows. We also love the design of the large format tiles that was used across the backsplash of the kitchen, which you will see similar ones at the dry kitchen later, okay. even for the countertop. So this is the part that I also like about the 3PLUS study mm. because we actually have a very nice backsplash of a dry kitchen over here that's yep. provided by the developer. Okay. So you can see the similar large format tiles that runs across the backsplash. Yep. This kind of dry kitchen, usually you only find it in the larger units, yes, like sure. the four and five bedrooms. Yep. So this is just a three bedroom and we already have extra circulation space and entertainment area for your guests. And we're here at the four bedroom, one, four, three, two square feet. Looks super amazing, Ken, please share us. So the size is already more sizable than a yes. lot of four bedrooms in the market. Yes. And if you can look through this entire design, the developers has brought in the luxury color scheme okay. as compared to the one to three bedrooms. Yep. So they're using darker tone for the panelings and their dry kitchen tiles and everything. Mm. So you can see the dry kitchen is actually made with a very beautiful large format tile without any grains in between, it's just right. one piece. Right, so the color theme is luxury, darker in tone, yep. um, across the entire unit. So instead, this is the key highlight of the four bedroom layout. I like it a lot because you can feel the space over yes, here. Yes, right? absolutely. So usually when we are talking about six meters frontage, yep. um, we have the living dining side by side. Correct. So this time around, we have the living standing alone by itself, mm -hmm. and it's already sitting on a 3.85 meters three Very nice. So there's all space in between as we tuck the dining over here. Down here has a lot of luxury to even feed up to a up to a 10 seater. Yeah. So this circulation space is so much bigger than a lot of the For units sure. that we have seen. So we've come to the end of another SRI New Home Showcase at Tembusu Grand. We hope you like what we shared today and of course seize the chance to own a piece of heritage at Tembusu Grand at the heart of Katong. So once again, we want to thank you Ken for your time and of course uh, if you would like to come on down, uh, please contact your preferred SRI salesperson to come on by to check out Tembusu Grand. Right. Once again, my name is Ainsley. I'm Ken. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.